Hello, e to lose community. This is Maricia Anglay taking you through your health and weight loss journey with e to lose Nutrition Bootcamp. I'm sharing a video. This is a bonus video from the first part as it relates to spacing out your meals. I want to share with you an analogy. Now you have a dryer. A, the dryer takes one hour to dry the clothes. You decide to stop it every five minutes to put more clothes in. So every five minutes you open the door, put another set of clothes in. And the first original clothes, set of clothes is still in there. What would happen to that original set of clothes and even the new ones that you're putting in? What would happen? It would not fully dry. It would not dry. Because you never gave time for the dryer to play its full course to dry the clothes before putting, putting in another load. Same thing with your system. When you pile, meal, snack, meal, snack, meal, snack, every three hours, before that four hours it takes to digest the food and the hour or two extra for it to take a break, the, the food is still sitting there, fermenting, spoiling. And while it's piling up, guess what you wanna do? You wanna gurgitate. Another reason for acid reflux, reason for constipation, reason for bloatedness, um, you know, sour stomach, stomach issues. The stomach, the digestive system is burdened because it had no break and food is constantly being piled up. So you would not eat every three hours, although it worked for weight loss, it doesn't work for health. If I overworked you, you would collapse, you would get sick, your immune system would be shot. Same thing with your digestive system. If you overworked it, eventually you're going to have issues with your organs and with your health. So to eat to lose, to eat to live, to eat to be healthy, you would space out your meals every five or to six hours. Eating at seven o'clock, counting eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, five hours later or six hours later would be one and then having lunch. And then having lunch, like I mentioned in the previous video, you had lunch, let's say, at one. So two, three, four, five, six. Six would be the third lunch, your dinner, which we mentioned in the book how it should be if you're gonna have that third meal and it's after six o'clock. So space out your meals, five to six hours. Be healthy, eat to live, eat to lose, so that you can be healthy. And if you don't have anything to lose and you're fine, do it to be healthy. Space out those meals, five to six hours. Give your stomach four hours to digest it work, its work and watch the inches come off. Watch the stomach go flat without actually having to work that hard. So you can still eat. You can actually eat to live, eat to lose. Spread the word. This is Marisa Anglade.